This is a game changer because astronomers have hit the jackpot. This is their dream come true. A new chapter in astronomy has opened up. After looking at 4,000 extrasolar planets, we finally found the closest one that looks very similar to the planet Earth. And that is Proxima Centauri b, a planet that goes around one of the stars in the triple star system. NASA has discovered a super Earth that could have conditions to sustain life. The new exoplanet is 137 light years away, or about roughly 800 trillion miles. Astronomers say the planet is about one and a half times the size of Earth and orbits a small reddish star that is cooler than our sun. Quite exciting. I mean, we haven't found an exact twin for the Earth. This isn't an exact replica, but out of this latest haul of 500 new possible planets, a bit bigger than the Earth, about 50% bigger. But it now, scientists are hailing a major discovery, a new planet which they've called Proxima b. At just four light years away, it's relatively close to us. It's roughly the same size as Earth, and because it's just the right distance away from its star, it could be the right temperature to have liquid water and possibly life. But gaze beyond our solar system to the next nearest star, Proxima Centauri, and that's 24 trillion miles away, which sounds a lot, but in space terms, it's our neighbour. It's been called Proxima b. It's slightly larger than Earth, and although its star is much cooler than our sun, the planet is in just the right zone for liquid water to exist on its surface. And that means that in theory, it could support life. The clearest image of Proxima b has just been revealed, glowing with lights that could change everything. Thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, we now have a snapshot of this Earth-sized planet only four light years away and it has caught scientists by complete surprise. Webb's image shows strange lights, possibly like those from cities here on Earth. Let us prepare ourselves for what might come next, as we may be on the brink of proving we are not alone. Alien lights, or nature's illusion, imagine staring at the night sky and realizing that something amazing, something potentially life-changing, is happening just a few light years away. That is the kind of excitement scientists are feeling right now about a newly captured image of Proxima b. Thanks to the incredible James Webb Space Telescope, we now know this is not just some random floating rock in the universe. It is a planet, a mere four light years away, that is roughly the same size as our Earth. Even more exciting, it is situated perfectly in its solar system's Goldilocks zone, where temperatures allow for liquid water, making it a strong candidate for potentially harboring life. And in the data, there's one detail, a mystery that could change everything we know about life out there. Let us step back for a second. This intriguing exoplanet orbits a star called Proxima Centauri, the nearest star to our solar system. At a distance of roughly 254 trillion miles, it is a big number. But when it comes to space, it is practically our next door neighbor. Imagine you could somehow look across those trillions of miles and see a place with mountains, oceans, and perhaps even an alien civilization staring back. It is a thrilling possibility, right? That is exactly what has scientists buzzing. The James Webb Space Telescope has only just begun its exploration, and already, it has blown our minds. This telescope's keen eye has picked up what seems like bright lights on the neighboring planet, Lights that resemble the glow from cities here on Earth. These are not just flares or random bursts of starlight. They are steady, organized patterns that hint at something more deliberate. The question burning in everyone's minds is whether these lights are a sign of intelligent life. Could it be that advanced beings are out there, organizing societies and lighting up the night as we do? We are on the verge of possibly changing our understanding of the universe, and it is hard not to get swept up in the excitement. Scientists are in awe, and rightly so. We have never been this close to proving that we are not alone. Think about it. Lights, seven trillion miles away, shining bright enough for our advanced telescopes to catch a glimpse of their glow. It is almost as if they've been waiting, waiting for us to catch up, to finally develop the tech capable of spotting them. These lights are making everyone reconsider the age-old question, are we alone? Could there really be someone out there? Maybe they are more advanced than us, or maybe they are just as curious about the universe as we are. David Kipping, 
an astronomer studying this exoplanet, mentioned that the planet seems quite complex. It does not behave like other rocky planets. Instead of just absorbing sunlight and releasing heat, it has a unique relationship with its star, Proxima Centauri, that is unlike anything we've seen. The James Webb Telescope is exactly the kind of tool we need to make sense of it all. It is picking up thermal emissions, giving us clues about what might be happening in the planet's atmosphere. But it's clear, we have only just begun to scratch the surface. One of the biggest perks of using the James Webb Telescope is its ability to observe in infrared. Most space telescopes struggle to see dim, distant lights in the vast darkness of space, but Webb makes it seem like child's play. That is why it is our best bet to confirm whether these satellite lights are real. Imagine what that could mean, potential proof of intelligent life. Organized societies, unknowingly making their presence known to us. This mysterious world has a unique day and night cycle. It is tidally locked, meaning one side always faces a star, experiencing eternal daylight, while the other side is trapped in endless night. This creates extreme temperature differences. If there is an atmosphere, it could moderate the temperatures, making one side livable instead of burning hot while the other freezes. And if there's an atmosphere, that means there's potential for liquid water, which, as you guessed, means there's a possibility of life. The telescope's next steps will be to dive deeper into that atmosphere. Scientists want to see if this fascinating planet's atmosphere contains gases like oxygen, methane, or water vapor, telltale signs of life. It will take time and careful study, but that's what this technology was built for. The James Webb Telescope wasn't specifically made to detect planetary atmospheres, but it's proving to be remarkably good at it. And if there's even a chance of finding an atmosphere rich with life-giving elements, it's worth every second. Even if Webb finds these promising gases, it's not the final answer. More observations, studies, and advanced telescopes will be needed. The good news is, the extremely large telescope ELT is already in the works and will come online in a few years. The ELT will have an even better chance of analyzing distant atmospheres in greater detail. Imagine being able to see not just hints of gases, but detailed pictures of what's happening on planets light -like years away. That's what scientists are hoping for, and it could change everything we know about the universe. The more we learn about Proxima b, the more surprising it becomes. The James Webb Telescope has been a game changer. It's already picking up clues about galaxy formation, stars, and solar systems, but most importantly, it's giving us a sneak peek into what might be the best chance we've ever had at finding alien life. The lights on this intriguing celestial neighbor could be anything, natural phenomena, reflections, or something we don't yet understand. But the idea that it might be a civilization is what has everyone excited. We are only just beginning to understand how life might thrive in places that look nothing like Earth. Take extremophiles, for example, Tiny organisms that survive in the harshest conditions, like boiling temperatures or highly acidic environments. If life can survive there, who's to say what might be possible on a world like Proxima b, with its extremes of hot and cold? Life is tough and if there is one thing we have learned from studying Earth, it is that living organisms can adapt to almost anything, if given the chance. And that brings us back to this enigmatic planet and those mysterious lights. Could they be a sign of something? Maybe they are evidence of a species that has learned to adapt, much like life on Earth. Or maybe we are looking at something that is not life at all, just a natural wonder we do not yet understand. Either way, it has got everyone talking. The universe is filled with endless mysteries, and this exoplanet is the latest one to capture our imaginations. This nearby world's unique relationship with its star, the unusual temperature differences, and the strange lights we are seeing, they are all pieces of a puzzle we are just beginning to put together. The James Webb Space Telescope has shown us that there is more out there than we ever imagined. It is a reminder that the universe is vast, and it is filled with wonders we can barely comprehend. This neighbor might not turn out to be a second Earth, but the possibilities it represents are thrilling. For now, all we can do is keep looking, keep wondering, 
and keep hoping that the answers are just around the corner. The distance of four light years to this nearby world is nothing compared to the scale of the universe, yet the potential discoveries from this nearby system could change our understanding of everything. This planet is about 1.2 times the mass of Earth, and its radius is slightly larger. The fact that it lies within the habitable zone, or what is often called the Goldilocks zone, means that it is neither too hot nor too cold for liquid water to potentially exist. This concept is fundamental to the search for extraterrestrial life, as liquid water is considered a key ingredient for life as we understand it. The host star of this fascinating planet, Proxima Centauri, is a red dwarf. Red dwarfs are smaller, cooler stars compared to our sun, but they are incredibly common throughout the galaxy, making up about 70% of all stars. This is important because, if life can exist around a red dwarf, it would significantly increase the number of potential habitable planets in our galaxy alone. Proxima Centauri emits much less light and heat compared to our sun, which means that this rocky neighbor orbits much closer to its star than Earth does to the sun. This proximity makes the planet more vulnerable to stellar flares and radiation, which might challenge the survival of any potential life forms. However, if this exoplanet has a magnetic field or a thick atmosphere, it might shield the planet from these harmful effects, giving life a fighting chance. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to detect infrared radiation is a crucial tool in studying worlds like this one. Infrared radiation can give us information about the temperature of a planet and the composition of its atmosphere. This is particularly helpful when trying to understand whether a planet could be hospitable to life. If this rocky body has an atmosphere, it would help to moderate the extreme temperature differences caused by being tidally locked to its star. Tidally locked means one side of the planet is always facing the star, resulting in a permanent day side and a permanent night side. Without an atmosphere, the day side would be unbearably hot, while the night side would be freezing. An atmosphere, if present, could help distribute heat, creating more moderate conditions across the planet. Scientists are hopeful that this neighboring world could have an atmosphere, as this would greatly increase the chances of it being habitable. By analyzing the light that passes through the planet's atmosphere when it transits in front of its star, scientists can look for specific molecules, such as water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane. These are considered biosignatures, as their presence could indicate biological processes. The James Webb Space Telescope has already demonstrated its capability to study the atmospheres of exoplanets, and its observations of this unique neighbor are eagerly awaited. Each new discovery on Proxima b takes us further into an exciting journey. The concept of biosignatures is central to the search for life beyond Earth. These are chemical compounds that are produced by living organisms, and their detection in an exoplanet's atmosphere could be the first hint of alien life. For example, on Earth, photosynthetic life produces oxygen, and its presence in large quantities is a strong indicator of life. Similarly, methane is often produced by biological processes, though it can also be produced by geological activity. The combination of different biosignatures, such as oxygen and methane, would be particularly compelling, as it would be difficult to explain their presence without some form of life. The possibility of intelligent life on Proxima b is even more intriguing. The lights detected by the James Webb Space Telescope resemble the lights produced by cities on Earth, leading to speculation that they could be evidence of an alien civilization. Of course, there are many possible explanations for these lights, and scientists are cautious about jumping to conclusions. They could be natural phenomena that we do not yet understand. However, the idea that we might be seeing the lights of an alien city is undeniably exciting. If true, it would mean that we are not alone in the universe and that there are other intelligent beings out there, perhaps wondering the same things we are. The potential discovery of intelligent life would have profound implications for humanity. It would change our place in the universe, showing us that we are not unique. It could also lead to new technologies and ways of thinking as we learn from an advanced civilization. However, there are also challenges. Communication across the vast distances of space would be incredibly difficult, 
taking years for a message to travel from Earth to Proxima B and back. There are also ethical considerations. How should we approach contact with an alien civilization? Should we even attempt to contact them? Or would it be safer to observe from a distance? These are questions that humanity will need to grapple with if we do find evidence of intelligent life. The James Webb Space Telescope is also helping us understand the broader context of Proxima b. By studying other planets and stars, it is giving us a sense of how common potentially habitable worlds are. The discovery of Proxima b, along with thousands of other exoplanets, suggests that planets are common in the galaxy. Many of these planets are in the habitable zones of their stars, meaning that they could have conditions suitable for life. The more we learn, the more it seems that our solar system is not unique and that there could be many worlds like Earth out there. The extremely large telescope ELT, set to come online in the next few years, will take this search to the next level. With its massive mirror, it will be able to study the atmospheres of exoplanets in even greater detail than the James Webb Space Telescope. It will be able to detect fainter signals and look for more subtle signs of life. The combination of the James Webb Space Telescope and the ELT will give us an unprecedented view of distant worlds, bringing us closer than ever to answering the question of whether we are alone in the universe. The search for life on Proxima b is just one part of a broader effort to understand our place in the cosmos. For thousands of years, humans have looked up at the stars and wondered if there is anyone else out there. We have imagined countless scenarios, from peaceful coexistence to interstellar conflict. Now, for the first time, we have the technology to begin answering that question. The discovery of Proxima b and the possibility that it could harbor life is a reminder of how much we still have to learn. The universe is vast, and our knowledge of it is still in its infancy. Every new discovery raises new questions and challenges our understanding of how things work. Proxima b might not turn out to be a second Earth, but it is a step on the path to finding one. It is a reminder that the universe is full of possibilities and that we are only just beginning to explore its wonders. Imagine a future where we have found not just one, but many planets like Proxima b. A future where we have confirmed that life exists elsewhere in the universe and perhaps even made contact with an alien civilization. It is a future that seems like science fiction, but it is one that we are moving towards, one discovery at a time. The James Webb Space Telescope is at the forefront of that journey, and its discoveries are bringing us closer to understanding our place in the cosmos.